How's it going everybody? Arthur Reyes here with winnersandminers.com and today we're going to be talking about one game for the Saturday, October 1st, 2022 slate. But before we get into that, I want to talk to you guys quickly about a promotion we are doing over at Winners and Winners where you can save up to 60% off of any premium package that you guys select. You're going to go to the description of this video. And you're going to click on my specific profile. You're going to see that there are about 7 to 10 different packages that you guys can choose from. Ranging from different sports to different amounts of time that you guys will have the bets. There you are going to decide which one you want. You're going to click on it. And at checkout you guys are going to use the promo code K943ART. All one word, no spaces. That is going to get you 60% off of those packages it's a steal of a deal why aren't you doing it already we're gonna win some money together and let's continue to just do that so make sure to check that out if you have not already so we're gonna be talking about some college football some mountain west football to be more specific as the new mexico lobos will travel to allegiant stadium to take on the unlv rebels now, this spread is currently sitting at UNLV minus 14, but I really like the underdog in this situation. New Mexico is 2-2. Two two. They're coming off a 38 to nothing road loss against the LSU Tigers, while UNLV is 3-1 and one and coming, no, also riding a two-game winning streak as they're coming off a 34-24 road win over the Utah State Aggies as well. Now, the difference in this team's are the defense. I really like New Mexico's defense. They're fourth in the Mountain West in total yards allowed at 355 and a half. They're third in rushing yards allowed at 110.8 yards per game. But those are just numbers. Those can change in the blink of an eye. The, the main factor is giving up points. Three of the first four games for New Mexico, they have allowed 14 or fewer points. You cannot say that about UNLV. Every game, their lowest point total allowed has been 20. So, this New Mexico defense has been stepping up. And really, it's been two guys that have really caused an impact this year. Senior safety, Jarek Reed II, who is leading the team in total tackles at 34, as well as having six pass deflections. So, that is stopping the passing game against them as well as sophomore linebacker Cody Moon, as he has really applied a lot of pressure to opposing quarterbacks, as he has three and a half sacks, as well as in the running game he's doing well, as he has 31 total stops for the season. That is leading the team as well. The UNLV offense is good. I do like their quarterback Brumfield, but this New Mexico defense is going to stop them enough and two full possessions is a lot of points to be giving up in this game. I think New Mexico is going to keep this around a 10-point difference. And all in all, I'm going to go with the New Mexico Lobos plus 14 on the, on the spread here to cover on the road. I think it's the better pick. I think that this defense is going to step up a little bit more. And... Really, I don't know what else to say. I don't love their quarterback in Kendrick as he is uh, throwing three touchdowns, three interceptions. But this team runs the ball pretty well. And I think they're going to be able to get the ball to senior wide receiver Gordon Porter. He has two of their three touchdown catches this year. And he is going to step up big time. But that's, again, we're going to go New Mexico plus 14. But that's all I have for you guys today. Tell me what you guys are thinking in the comment section. Leave a like, subscribe if you have not already, and I will see you guys in the next one.